Hey everybody, continuing our series on indoor plants. Again, indoor plants, great, great way to ward off the seasonal depression, winter blues, and keep that green space inside that we uh, love so much to have uh, on the outside in the spring, summer, and fall. Uh, so today we're talking about uh, cactus and succulents. Now, uh, these are two great options, especially if you're not very familiar with indoor plants. They take very little maintenance and sometimes they're actually better off when forgotten. Uh, so specifically, if you can look behind me, we've got a good selection here of uh, both some uh, succulents. Uh, there is uh, a variety of cactus here. And then we've got some aloe plants. And up above me, we've got some uh, exotic angel plants, hanging, vining plants. These are all great options. Um, you can go out to your uh, local uh, store around here in Princeton. I know you have Blooms, Flowers by Julia. You can always check out Home Depot, Walmart, anywhere like that and get these plants. Uh, so just a couple quick recommendations on uh, succulents and cactus. Really the biggest problem is overwatering. So with these plants, you wanna make sure you're not watering too often. And for us, usually that means we're watering our succulents about once, uh, once a week to once every 10 uh, days, sometimes two weeks is okay even. Uh, if you're starting to see them stress, usually it's overwatering. And then with cactus, usually we're only watering once a month or once every six weeks on those. And then light, uh, follow the directions on the label when you buy them, but generally being in uh, full to partial sunlight is fine when it comes to these types of plants. Uh, these are all in a south exposure uh, window, so that uh, makes them you know, get most sunlight almost all uh, day long, so it is okay. Uh, one thing is if you do notice a lot of webbing on them, it's usually mites. Uh, working on them. So you can go to the hardware store, get a spray that has bifenthrin as the active ingredient or says miticide, and just lightly spray them once or twice, uh, and it usually takes care of it. So uh, I'll go over a little bit more detail on the composition of what should go into um, repotting and putting succulents and other uh, varieties of cactus and uh, angel plants because they do prefer a certain kind of uh, potting mix. So I will go over that and the potting process in another video coming up here soon. So we'll see you again soon. Thanks.